What's up YouTube? Got another video for you today. Now this video is inspired by a comment I got. Um, I can't remember the user. Uh, it was I think about an hour ago he commented uh, um, how um, you know a different way you can um, inhale a cigarette and it gave me the idea you know I honestly inhale cigarettes several different ways and I honestly wanted to show you guys um, the different ways you can inhale a cigarette <clears throat> and also just so you guys know tomorrow I should be getting the palm oil unfiltered cigarettes um, I have a whole carton that I ordered for my tobacco store because again when I initially ordered them they never actually ordered them and it, they never came in on the truck but um, another little update about filming in here anytime I film in here I do have to kind of be careful because we have found about four uh, snake skins in the shed um, over the past three weeks so whether they're just a black snake garden snake or a copperhead um, God only knows but there are um, quite a few copperheads down here so I'm sure at least one or two of the snake skins were copperheads so I just you know you want to be careful whenever you're uh, messing around with uh, shit like that because if I were to get bitten by a copperhead uh, I'd be in the ER <coughs> but um, yeah so we're gonna go ahead and get our cigarette out so the cigarette we're gonna be doing this with is just a regular old lucky strike Go ahead and get one of these out and we're gonna of course pack it down as I try not to uh, drop my Zippo on the damn floor in here. Okay, that should be good enough. And again, as you guys know, I like packing my unfiltered cigarettes down in the opposite direction so that way I'm not getting a mouthful of tobacco every fucking time I take a drag off of the cigarette. Now, I'm going to go ahead and explain to you how I do the first drag off of my cigarette as I'm lighting. So what I normally do is as I'm lighting, I puff on the first one. So I pull it into my mouth. I don't inhale, then exhale it. And then once it's lit, I take it I take the lighter away from it and then I act as if I'm going to puff again, pulling a bunch of smoke into my mouth, but instead of bl just blowing the smoke out of my mouth and not inhaling it, I then take the cigarette away from my mouth and then take a deep inhale. And then all that smoke that was in your mouth goes down into your lungs and then you exhale it. So that's what we're gonna be doing first. So. So that is basically, you know, and, and there really isn't any correct way to take a drag off of a cigarette. I mean, it's all in personal choice. Um, what gets you the best buzz, honestly, is what I would go by when doing stuff like this. But I can do that again, which is actually, believe it or not, how I used to uh, take hits off of vapes. I would fill my mouth up with the vape um, vapor and then take the vape away and then actually inhale. Because if I just sat there and inhaled off the vape like that, I would be uh, choking myself. Because the first vape that I ever purchased, um, I tried doing that too and uh, I coughed and hacked for quite some time afterwards. So then my cousin was like, yo, that this is how I do it. And I was like, oh damn, that actually works pretty good. But So we take a puff off of the cigarette into our mouth. And again, I don't normally do that the whole length down of the cigarette. I just do that like the first time. So that way I'm not wasting the first bit of smoke really um, on my cigarette. But the second way, 
is of course just taking a regular drag off of the cigarette and just inhaling it like this. Which, you know, because most of the people I'm guessing that are going to be watching this video already are smokers. So, and again, I don't condone smoking to anyone under the age of 18. However, if you are over the age of 18, as I say in almost all my videos, um, I believe it should be your choice. And this is the first cigarette of the day, so I already am getting quite buzzed off of this cigarette. <clears throat> but the next way, of course, is just like the last way, however, you exhale through your nose, which gives you uh, more of the full flavor of, uh, the, especially with Lucky Strikes, you'll be able to taste much more of the toasted, nice, rich, toasted tobacco flavor, so. And again, anytime you do that, if you wanna taste the full flavor of whatever you're smoking, exhaling through your nose, again, because your nose has a lot to do with your uh, taste buds and taste um, in your body, you'll be able to taste the cigarette a lot better, at least in my opinion. And there's also another way uh, that you can take drags off of cigarettes, which is a double drag, which is where you just go like this, which I'm about to show you, you just take And those tend to get you, at least for me, uh, quite buzzed if you take double hits and that goes the same for vapes with me as well. If I take a double drag off of a vape, which anytime I do take a hit off of a vape, I'm always doing the pulling the smoke into my mouth, then inhaling. Because again, for me at least, uh, if I try to actually just directly inhale the vape, um, I wind up coughing and hacking which I don't really know why, but uh, I guess it's just how I do it or whatever. But so, and then you can also do a mixture of all different kinds, like, like I kind of just did in that, in that one, like you can, You really couldn't see that. And I also find it after you light the cigarette, it's much harder to just pull the smoke into your mouth and then inhale it. So I'm going to try that again. Yeah, that's a lot better. Because when you're pulling the smoke into your mouth, again, like in my How to Smoke a Cigarette tutorial, um, you really want to uh, block off the air that's getting into your mouth as well because if you um, try doing that and you're just like like this like you don't get as much smoke with it as you would if you were actually full-on sealing the cigarette within your lips so that's all that's being inhaled or pulled into your mouth. But again, those are just the, the three basic ways that I smoke a cigarette. I'm sure there's other ways, stuff like smoke tricks and other things like that. Like I can see if I can do a ghost real quick. So that would be another way if you like doing ghosts and things like that, which are quite popular with vapes. You can, uh, again, just pull the smoke into your mouth, then push it out of your mouth and then, you know, try to inhale the cloud of smoke that you just pushed out of your mouth. So that technically, I guess, could be the fourth way that you could smoke a cigarette if you want to be cool or edgy or whatever have you. <clears throat>
But how I normally just smoke my cigarette is I just inhale it and then push the smoke out through my nose, which I think would be considered the nasal exhale. But anyway, guys, that's going to do it for this video. Um, don't really have much more to say because, again, those are the four basic ways that um, I smoke a cigarette. Now, if you guys have any other ways to smoke a cigarette, be sure to leave them in the comments because I'd like to know and possibly like to try them. Um, I've never actually attempted smoking a cigarette through my nose. Um, I would assume that would be quite painful <laughs> to do if you want my honest opinion. But um, if you like the video, like, share, comment, subscribe, anything you do helps, and I'll see you in the next video.